Suspect arrested with five pistol and live ammunition around along Okene Hauchi Road, Benin. What he said, who is sponsoring him, will shock you. You know, lately, not just Benin, I mean, uh, every part of the country, most parts of the country, so let me not say every part, most parts of the country has been complaining of insecurity and what have you. A lot of people are not happy with the current state of the security situation of the country. Most people have spoken against it, has kicked against it, and the list is endless. So much so that the Southwest governors have heard meeting, brought up new laws, and what have you. A suspect was apprehended. Five pistols were found with him and life ammunitions. Along Okene, Hauchi Road, Benin. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe if this is your first time. Thank you. Let's hear what he has to say. It was learned that the suspect was traveling from Abuja from, for Bini. It was learned that the suspect was traveling for Abuja from Benin in a Toyota Camry where he was intercepted by the police who found five pistols and magazines fully loaded with live ammunition on him. The suspect was thoroughly squeezed by the police before he started spilling the beans on his mission and who was who he was working for that's the point you will be amazed to hear we always tell you that when you see these things happening in a particular region go and investigate there is someone from that region who is benefiting who is aiding encouraging them to carry out such atrocity you know like the fulani headsmen in the whole of the federation you know that the federal government have a soft spot for them They've told them they're untouchable. Continue. Nobody can touch you. It's evident. So, let's continue. The suspect admits to being a citizen of Gaza in Abuja and a Gawadara-speaking person. From this, it could be guessed that he is also an Abuja native. The suspect is, an, is from Abuja. He also, he claimed... He hailed from Yabula Amer family. When asked who he was working for, he said he was working for a community chairman in Airport Road, Benin. A community chairman in Airport Road, Benin. Community chairman will be looking at people and anybody that offends him, he will tell these people, this person is coming from Abuja. He's not in Benin. People that are coming to commit a crime, he will... He will connect them, ring them up, and ask them to start coming. Are you hearing what is going on? With all that he had confessed under interrogation, it could be suggested that whatever his mission was, it has already been accomplished, and he was already leaving back for Hausa land, where he resides. Effort has been made to reach this community chairman in Benin, and he himself is under further interrogation from the police, who hope to squeeze further useful information from him. So guys, be careful. This person is very, in the, in the eyes of everybody, in the eyes of, you know, of you and I, you are looking at the person today, he's seeing you, you are seeing him, and you will never guess he's the one aiding and committing this atrocity. Then when the place get heated up, you will tell them, well, yeah, go back, go back, I'll tell you when to come. Can you understand what they are doing now? When the place get heated up, police are already, you know, chasing the people, following the trail, intercepting them, apprehending them, and, you know, trying to, guess what? He will ask them, and we are, go, 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 go for now. Take over, you know? Let, let's, uh, let, let's wait, let this, let this storm go down. I will tell you when to come. You will give them money, and they will go. Do you understand? <laughs> oh, my people. Uh, I'm telling you, this is what is going on now as we speak. This guy was intercepted. You know the way police would just stop some random vehicles and, you know, just check them. Just say, where are you going to? What do you have there? What do you have there? And they found this one with life ammunitions. And this is what... He was carrying with him 
and this is what he has to say. Can you see that? You know, they always, there's this um, adage from one of the tribes in Nigeria which says the insect that is eating the leaf is found right inside the leaf. The insect that is eating the leaf, the insect that is causing, you know, the leaf, the whole uh, uh, structure of a leaf that is making it rather shapeless, biting it off. It's not somewhere else. It does not come and go. It's already residing inside the leaf. You know, you, what we can only pray now is that that guy be apprehended, that that guy be found. That's one, because the suspect was found. There are several of them across the country. He's in Benin. Look at the distance the guy will have to travel all the way to get to Benin, to come and commit this atrocity. Only God knows how long he has been in, in Benin. Or probably, let's even make a wide guess, there is, uh, probably there is an election coming, and he sees that the opponent is being preferred by the people over him. Guess what he will do? He will ask them, come, 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 go and, do, go and kill that man. They will come in quietly. The man is driving past. They will tell you his hoodlums. My dear, the man did not, he is not hoodlum, so it was a well-calculated assassination attempt or attack on him. Why? Somebody has instructed these ones to go and do this, such an atrocity to them. It did not just happen. I repeat, it did not just happen. It was aided, it was calculated, it was determined, it was something that people somewhere have done. So this is what goes on in our country. From the very top, you see these b-boys in the north ravaging. Where do they get the ammunitions from? How do they get it? I tell you what, someone in procurement eh, for the army, for the police, someone who is procuring ammunitions for the country is also procuring for these people and sending it to them. How come none of them has been intercepted when they are buying a sophisticated weapon? How come? Ask yourself that question and think about it deeply. They will even use soldiers to go and deliver it to them. You think it's just happening? Uh, my dear, they are not that sophisticated. There are people already, yeah, legitimate uh, uh, force men that are aiding it, government officials from presidency. That's why it's being followed. Leave us a comment. God bless you. Bye for now.